Hi there, I wanted to give a little overview of the PPP loans and the history of where we're at on the taxable side of them and uh, talk a little bit about uh, a basis issue that a lot of people are bringing up and, and thinking about and me included. Uh, so first off, the PPP loans came about as the CARES Act that was passed back as the coronavirus and the pandemic was getting going and things were getting shut down. And when Congress passed it, passed the law, the CARES Act, so here we have Congress, they said not taxable. So we have Congress saying these should not be taxable. Then the IRS came out on a couple of occasions and they said, okay, we agree, it's not taxable based on the law, but the expenses that you pay with that loan are not deductible. Which, if you think about it, if you pay for an expense and it's not deductible, it's basically income, the, the way that it works. And so it's a way to get around it not being taxable, but it's also a way to, to make it taxable. You know, so it doesn't hit our income line to be taxable, but it reduces our expense, which in effect makes it taxable. So that's why Congress, members of Congress have come out and said to IRS uh, to respect Congress wishes, right? So Congress came back to the IRS and said, hey, IRS, when we passed this law, we said it should not be taxable. You've now come and said the expenses are not deductible, which basically makes it taxable. We want you to respect our wishes. We respect the wishes of Congress and let businesses deduct the expenses. And so that's where we're at right now is you have IRS saying you can't deduct the expenses and members of Congress saying that's not what, what our wishes were when, when we passed that law. We want this to be deductible. And so now where we're currently at, we have the AICPA, which is the American uh, Institute of Certified Public Accountants and many others, we'll put many others, are calling on Congress to clarify that one, the income that from the PPP loans is not taxable, and two, expenses paid with the PPP loans are deductible, that businesses can deduct those. So that brings up a, a really difficult tax issue. And the tax issue is that when you take a deduction on a tax return, you have to have basis to take that deduction. So how do you get basis to take a deduction when you never took income for the loan that came in? So money came in to your business, you weren't taxed on it, it was money you were never taxed on, so you have no basis necessarily when that comes in, you now pay for an expenses that reduce your income, but you have no basis to take those deductions. So how do we solve that? What do we do? Well, the answer uh, came from a tax seminar that I attended this week, where it is in the tax law that tax exempt income okay so tax exempt income so income that comes into a business that is not taxable you can think of this like municipal bond income and things like that but tax exempt income increases basis so if these loans that, had, that came into the business, if now we say that they are tax exempt income, which is my, I, my understanding of what Congress meant when they passed the law, that it increases the owner's basis in that company, in that business, and allows them to then take deductions for uh, the PPP loan, the PPP expenses that they had for the payroll, the rents, and those things that count for the PPP expenses, they can deduct those, and um, there's no basis issues or anything like that.